Hello, hello, hello. How is everybody doing? Top of the morning to you. It is 12 o'clock in the afternoon on Tuesday. Tuesday, Tuesday, Tuesday. Yes, instead of doing Twitch, I figured I'd do this just because I have some drama. You guys know how I get down, right? Jay's a drama queen. He's a faggy bitch. He doesn't stop complaining. He always has something to complain about. He's got a tiny dick. It seems like more people are worried about me than I'm worried about me. And I guess that's a good thing. But before we get into that, how is everybody feeling? How's everybody doing? Spade, Vendetta. Uh, what do we got? Jason. Phoenix Vapes. Long time no see. John. What's up, dude? I was wondering where you were yesterday, man. I figured I just scared you away. It's got to be that American accent. Beard Nye, the drum guy. What's up, man? Jimmy Wolf. Ray Dan, I'm just not going to call everybody out. There's way too many people for me to do this. So, uh, in the title, it goes without saying, you do have to mind the lovely woman behind me. I have no idea who she is, but she just wanted to show off her breasts. And that's what she's going to do. Just make sure your nipple doesn't pop out for you. Okay, we are good to go. So, um, yeah. It's going to be some fun drama here. Basically... I've got two things I want to cover. Now, before you use the argument and say that I'm starting shit, I promise you that this has nothing to do with me. I had no idea I was being dragged into this until uh, this morning. <sighs> you know, if, no matter what genre you go into, if you go into a knitting field or like a car field, like cars are different, right? Like ca cars, there's so much drama. Like my Honda's better than your Acura. It's the same fucking company. Or my Infinity's better than your Nissan. It's also the same fucking company. Or my Lexus is better than your, your Toyota. It's also the same company. So no matter what field, you, I'm sure that even in the contractor field or like a carpenter would be like, man, my work is harder than you, Mr. Mason Man. And then the Mason Man's like, dude, I got to carry rocks up a fucking ladder, dude. So I'm sure that there's always drama and everything. So when people are like, oh my God, Jay brought all this drama to fucking vape. Let me tell you something. The thing is with vapes, right, is vaping is designed designed in theory and and idea and execution to get people to stop smoking cigarettes, right? That's what it's designed for. But then you have people like me that take it a step further. Now I'm going into the hobbyist side. So anytime you have a hobby, like if you fly helicopters, someone's going to be like, dude, I fly a drone. I don't have to look at my helicopter. You understand? So there's, there's always going to be somebody that wants to either shit in your kitchen sink or has got to be better than you because they live such a pathetic, mundane life that it just makes them feel better when they, I don't want to say subconsciously talk about you. So there's only a select amount of reviewers, right, of vape products, right? There's, I don't know, if I, if I had to take a poke at it and say the mainstream vape reviewers, if we're going based off of sheer subscriber amount, there's what, five, right? So you got Mike Vapes, Rip Trippers. I, I don't even want to consider Rip Trippers a reviewer. Suck my mod, Grim Green. Oh, there's more than five. Myself, uh, I said Mike Vapes, Vape and Bogan. I'm, I'm trying to go over 100K here. Hold on. I'm going to credit Vic. Vic, I'm going to give him a high five. Okay, that, that's all that I have. That that. Let me try that one more time. Rip Trippers, Grim Green, Suck My Mod, Mike Vapes, me. Vaping Bogan, Vaping with Vic. Okay, that's all that I have. Uh, now, you could get into smaller numbers, right? You could say Ambitions Vapor. You could say Todd, but he hides his subs, so I have no idea. Um, oh, DJ LSB. Oh, my God. I totally fucking forgot about him. DJ LSB. So you got, like, what, 10 people? Well, <laughs> above 100K, you got seven, six, right? Whatever. Okay. So I got an email this morning from a company that I bought in high end from. 
I do find that a little odd what's in this email, though, because they're targeting me. You see Bree's face, because this is why I didn't tell Bree, because I wanted that shock value. So they're targeting me in the email. Now, when you read this email, we're going to read it together. We are. We're going to read it together. And then you tell me who else you think of when you hear this. Are you ready? This is going to be fucking fun. Let's look at this email. So this is the email, right? Exclusivity at its finest. The CEO or chow, <laughs> whatever the fuck. How would you say that? Ciao. Ciao. Hey, Mike, can you come here for a moment and tell me how you would say this? Just this word right here. Well, how would you say, come here, this word. What, what would you get out of that? Xiao. Xiao. Okay. Xiao. So it's Chinese. Got it. <laughs> okay. Sorry. Uh, sorry. You go back to work. All right. So, and then you have this little essentials here. Now, um, it says, hold the presses. They made another thing together designed in a shed. We know that that's Todd's review. The guy that reminds you of Shrek, right? We've all seen that. And so, so engineered in Croatia. Buy it now and watch it being smashed by a guy a few weeks later. Okay. 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 So when you heard that, right? Now, I didn't modify that email. That's what that email says. What do you think of a guy that's going to smash it? No one gives a shit about a guy in a shed. No one cares. No one cares about where it's engineered, although I do. And so should you, especially if you're paying top dollar for something that's made in fucking China. That's that. Uh, so uh, so why, why, why having multiple hands in a pot? Right, like me. Let, let, let me. Let, let's go back. Right. So, so they're talking about me. Uh, who else would you be talking about? Who else is gonna break a vape product? Me. I'm the guy with the little mini sledgehammers. So I emailed the company. I said, "Wow, what's this about?" You know what their response to me was? I'm gonna read it to you. No way. Here's what the response is. Who are you? Ah! Yo, wait. Let me pull this up. Let me pull up this camera. <laughs> Yo, this motherfucker said, who are you? Ah, uh, dude, <laughs> but wait for it. Wait, if we scroll, shit, hold on. If we scroll, I talked to this guy. Look, back in June 6th, <laughs> click this, and it's the same fucking dude. <laughs> hey, Jay, I had the mods purchase. I'm asking about a special mod. I wanted to buy this mod. So he fucking spoke to me. And this guy is so damn stupid. He totally fucking forgot who I am in, in two months, three months. I'm sorry. Let's go to September 6th. Okay. You didn't have a problem. Remember who I was. Who, who told you to write that email? Was it Todd or was it Sasha? It definitely wasn't China. So it was either the so, so engineered guy in Croatia, or it was, um, it was the guy in the shed. You know you got a fucking problem is, is when people don't even know you by name. They just know you as the guy in the shed. I think of like a pedophile, right? Or like a molester. Like, uh-oh, don't go in those woods. There's a guy in the shed. Like, that's <laughs> that's what I think of when I hear a guy in the shed. I'm not like, yeah, that's a guy that does vape videos. Like, no one thinks of that. I think that that's the worst misleading bar. Like, there's going to be a clown that's going to fuck you in the butt and steal your ice cream. That's what I get out of the guy in the shed. You don't like you don't like clowns. I don't like midgets, but we're not here for that, right? We're here to talk about the guy in the shed, so so engineered in Croatia. But guys, keep in mind that these products are made in China, right? But there's three hands dipping in. Don't worry, we're not done yet. We're just starting. You got three hands dipping in. You got Todd, who has this this vendetta against me. I guess because I called him out because he had originally deleted the RDA that I sent him to do a review on, which was mine. And then he put it up, and he made it seem like it was up. But I have videos live showing that channel and showing that that video was deleted. Whatever. That's because of, I don't know, I I have no fucking idea why he does the shit that he does. I, I don't know. The guy hides his sub. There, there says, can you look him up real quick? Oh, yeah. Look up Todd's review, see if he shows his subs. You know, I, I, and maybe I shouldn't be taking this to heart, but I look at their Facebook group, right? And I read their comments. And some of those people, like they say that I'm drama. When you go into my Facebook group, Wicks and coils. You'll never, ever, ever, ever see drama. Never. The mods do not tolerate it. The mods. Not even me. I'm never in the fucking place. Does it show us up? No. 
I rest my case. You know you have a bad situation is when you hide your fucking subs. You're that embarrassed that you've been doing reviews for, oh, I don't know, 10 years? And Brie has more subs than you? And Brie doesn't even do a fucking video on her channel? <laughs> That's a spicy meatball right there. Um. So anyway, um, I forgot what I was fucking saying. Right, so he del- so he deletes whatever he deleted the video. We got this problem, and he just got this vindictive attitude towards me. And they want to make these little jokes, but you 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 have three hands dipping in a pot when you're getting something made in China, and 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 the person this this Sasha individual. I've done reviews on the poet, the jazz. I I think I like the the jazz. I didn't like the poet, and then whatever. Right, it, it, it's it's like this guy. He, they're they're ready. Oh, back to the drama. So they they want to throw out fucking shade, especially a Sasha piece of shit. These motherfuckers don't got balls. That they're gonna. These are they're people that will put a face to their trolling, but they won't do it in real life. See where I'm at. If you have something nasty to say, you say it to somebody's face. You don't say it over the internet, right? But a lot of these people they hide. And and they look at it like I'm cool because I'm gonna make funny slide jokes. It's just what are the what are the Brits called? Where are my Brits at? Dan, uh, Frankie, where are you guys at? Where you guys you call it slate or something? Slate? Why are you slating me, yo? Or how do they say it? Say it in British accent. Why are you slating me? Why are you slating me? There you go. That that so that that's what you guys sound like. I don't know. Um, or throwing shade, whatever the fuck you call it. So yeah, taking a piss out of somebody. <laughs> Why would you want to do that? That just sounds. They're taking a piss. Okay, we should be in front of a fucking urinal, not standing in the middle of the burrito shop. <laughs> but they're they're so ready to throw shade. But when you look at like Wix and Coles, there's no drama. But we're all drama. You're putting me in a fucking email. Like who else are you talking about? Either Steam Island wrote it, you wrote it, or Sasha wrote it. That's it. One of those three. So stand the fuck up and say something. You know what's weird? They're, they're not even mentioning anybody. They didn't mention Todd. They just said the shed fellow. They didn't mention who's making it. They just said this guy who's eh from the Philippines. Or no, Croatia. Croatia. See, that's what I'm saying. It didn't even make you remember. It's <laughs> terrible marketing. <laughs> like, oh, we, we, we got a product made somewhere. Oh, okay. Made by somebody. Yeah, in the middle of nothing. Designed Great. by something. <laughs> <laughs> made with rocks. Good. Okay, I'm going to buy that. Uh, yeah, terrible marketing. Uh, but, it, you know, it's just like, stand the fuck up, right? It's... And people say I'm drunk. Oh my God, yo! At least I got the balls to call somebody out by fucking name. And what am I gonna have one hater over here? Block. That's all. <laughs> Shut it down. One. For every one hater, there's five hazers. Aw, that should be a shirt. <laughs> For every one hater, there's five hazers. Yeah. Because you got that one guy that talks shit, and then he gets hit by about twenty other hazers. <laughs> oh shit! I'm outnumbered. Somebody help me. <laughs> Help me, Jesus! Please put your hand on me, Jesus. Here, drink this. <laughs> drink this rainwater. <laughs> it's just like uh, we're gonna we're gonna keep going. I'm gonna keep going with this. I'm gonna keep going. Let's go round two. Ready? This is gonna attract a lot of attention. Uh, why why are we not talking about this new Duatofo situation with Mister Just Right One? Let's talk about this. So the guy just came out with a mod that's not even out yet. Now he's coming out with a dripper that uses two strips of mesh instead of one. Like if one mesh wasn't enough. Now you just have to dump a 30 mil into your dripper and vape that. <laughs> that's that's where we're at right now. So if you can't let, let me tell you something. When you people are like, man, I get no flavor from my coils. Uh, only works on mesh. You need to learn how to fucking build. Number one. Uh thank you for the super chat. Thank you, Patrick. Uh we have to talk about this. We do, we do, because this is the one that told me, ask your bitch. Or no, that's the sticker. The sticker. He, he called Brie a bitch, and that's when I did the video on it. This is a guy pretending to be something he's not. You know, this is a guy trying to be a fucking thug, but he's making vape products. When's the last time you've been to the ghetto? You grew up in Newark, right? Oh, yeah. You, you, ever, you ever see one of the people on the corners? Right, we got to watch what we say here, but you ever see the people on the corners making cars or making metal in Newark? Like actually being productive? Other than trapping? No. <laughs> So it's not a thing that you think of. When I think of a thug, I think of somebody that's going to rob me, not make some shit. What's this guy? He's going to push the button. Yep. Oh, my gosh. Hold on. Let me get it. Hold on. Oh, I'm 
I was gonna answer it on no, here, then you can show them. Hello? Hey, are you guys open? Who are you? What What are you for, vape? Yeah, vape. Yeah, no, we're closed. We're not a vape store anymore. Oh, really? Yeah. No, we don't do any vapes. We're a scooter shop. What is it? A scooter shop. Oh, a scooter shop? Yes. Oh, all right. Okay. So I had to do that because of all the ghetto-ness, right? Some people will be trying to bang on the door, so I got this little security system now. Oh, I had a great idea. What? No, wait. Hold on. Let me finish okay. this. So you don't you don't see that. Like, you don't see somebody, because he, he acts ghetto, right? He, and it kind of bothers me. I Look, I it bothers me because... He, he talks a lot of shit that he created all these things. He didn't fucking create nothing. He slapped his name on it. That's what he did. Name slapper. Oh, look, something's from China's coming out. I'll put my name on that like I made that. You do know, you, you guys do know that Watofo is smoke, right? Like everybody knows that. So if you have the same regard or same hate for smoke, you should have that same hate for Watofo, right? It's funny because we go back to what we were just saying that, I, man, this video is just all fucking drama where people are like, man, I, I love Lamborghini. Oh! I love Porsche so much. And then I'm like, bro, you do know that that's Volkswagen, right? Nah, that ain't Volkswagen. I fucking hate that company. Nope. I promise you it is. I promise you the same people involved in that are getting paid by Volkswagen. I'm just, I'm, I'm just letting you know. No, nah. no. Nah, I like Bentley then. Also Volkswagen. <laughs> I like Bugatti. Also Volkswagen. I like Seat. Also Volkswagen. I like Skoda. Also Volkswagen. I like Ducatis. Also Volkswagen. So, uh, yeah, anyway. But but the, the, I, I don't know. I, I don't know. I, I have to start calling people out for the name slap. I, I, I got to do it. I got to do it. Like, you just... I, I don't, I, like, you need to just sit the fuck down. You got your money from your profile. Just sit down. Just sit down. Just sit down. Same thing with Todd and Sasha. Sasha's the guy from Croatia that I thought I was cool with, but he just likes to talk shit and try to be funny. I hope one day I go to Croatia. Where am I? Who do we have that's Croatian that are hazers? Do we have any? No, probably not because there's only eight people that fucking live there and they all fuck each other. So there's that. See, that's the difference though, Mike, is I talk that shit to face. I don't do it over the internet. I do. I don't do it. I'll do it over the internet, but I'll do it face to face too. The best thing is, too, is if you want to you wanna come see me, I got no problem. I got cameras. We could go viral. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't saying Zophie, though, because Zophie, she, she's all right. Zophie's all right. But um, his response now, now he responded to me. Now he says, hold on, let me go back in his email. Wait. Ah, the man himself. What do you need, Jay? I just showed you the picture. This fucking guy. That pumps me up. <laughs> Who told you to write that in the email? Smashed by a guy a few weeks later. Now, you know what they're doing. They're hustling right now. Sasha's emailing Rob from Steam Island. Hey, 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 this guy. Don't say it was me. Say it was my wife. I didn't do it. I didn't do it. Hurry up. Tell him. You didn't tell me Jay was subscribed to our emails. <laughs> they changed the word design to collaboration. Yeah, you know what, Kevin? I see you on these shits. Talking shit to people. Uh, you know, what the fuck, man? You know, None of these people are designing shit, man. They're not designing nothing. Like, you're not designing anything. You're not sitting with a fucking napkin and drawing some shit and sending it out to China. Now, now I will say this. I will say this. Sasha, uh, the guy from um, fuck. Just give me a second. Oh shit! What's the company? Van and Dell. Van and Dell. Van and Dell Design. Um, yeah, now. Say that in chat, so I'm guessing. No, I'm checking. Okay. Van and Dale design. There we go. Uh, now I, I'm sure that he does. I'm sure that he does design because he did the poet, the poet, he did the jazz, he did the uh, the RTA. I'm sure he does. Todd? No. Mm -mm. Nope. Nope. Not at all. Um. 
Mr. Dress Right? Absolutely not. Stop saying you're a fucking designer. Stop. Show me your LLC for your design company. Why don't we start there? If you're American, if you're overseas, I don't know. What are you having, Dan, uh, for when you registered the business? You registered the business in UK? Our business? What is that? What do you have in UK? We call it like an LLC. Limited Liability Company, Corporation, S Corp, C Corp. What is it called in UK? Oh, Theatro. There you go. That's that's the RTA. Yeah. So uh, you have something, right? You have a you have a business. Show me show me if you're a design company that you're designing shit, and show me your registered business. You know, Mister Just Right One don't have that shit. Nope. But he's real as fuck. Trust and believe that. My gold chain hanging out like Mister T. <laughs> I pity the fool. <laughs> LTD, that's what you guys call it over there. Oh, instead of LLC. What is that? L limited trademark distribution? Where's he going? I don't know. I just thought you gave him the key. No, nah, don't give him a key. Oh, no. So that it's, we're coming in and out right now. So we're just buzz him in. Just buzz him in. I'm tired of these fake ass fucking people. Like that. What's going on, everybody? Deuces Jack here. Yeah, he made that RDA. He sat down, and he, God, I am just calling all types of fucking people out. I'm, I'm sorry. This is just all drama. I'm just, I have to say something, man. I, ha I was going to do this on Twitch, but I was like, ah, no one's really going to watch this. Oh, nobody told me what's to write, so that's him that did it. Ah. 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 So it's him. Well, that's interesting. That's a different spin of things now. Why you write that, bro? I asked him that already. Uh, he says, um, nobody tells me what to write in my email campaigns, mate. We are an independent shop and don't really care about other people's opinions. You don't care about other people's opinions. Really? Do you think Google cares about personal opinions? I would think so. If you're an independent shop, I would. I mean, I don't. I don't know what kind of shop you're running, but I would think so. Why is it that you have a problem with what we do or what we say? Is this has got to do anything with you in any way? Um. Yeah. You said the guy that breaks things. A few weeks later. That's me. Yes, I have a problem with that. This guy, yo. Oh my God. Oh my God. Vape, UK vape scene is toxic as fuck right now. That's good because it used to be Americans, right? Like, you guys, you, you know how I get down, right? Like, you guys in UK be like, ah, you people from America are just cocky, fat, and bearded, and vape. You guys are ugly. Stop talking shit. It's to stop people from smoking cigarettes, right? But now that there's less people in America vaping, you guys are kind of picking up, but we, we dropped, right? We let it go. We said, ah, fuck it, we're out. We're out. We're going to go back to smoking cigarettes. We're going to smoke weed now because we potheads, yo. Shit's about to get real. It's lit. About to get turnt up in here. Uh, and I can talk like that. I can't. Because I want to. Because I write my own email campaigns, mate. Uh, <laughs> you love yeah, don't, don't, call, call, don't call me fucking mate. I'm not your fucking mate. We ain't fucking. Like, I don't even know you. <laughs> don't don't call me mate. Like, what? <laughs> anyway. Um, I, I don't know. I, I didn't find that fucking fascinating that this guy wrote that email. And he doesn't even know who I am. So if you wrote that, who the fuck were you referencing then? Show me another vape reviewer. Where's Steam Island in this chat? Let me get a chat. So he could be one of three people. So he's not there. Let's try this. Uh, no, he's not there either. I, I don't know. He's not. He's, maybe he's under a different name in YouTube. But I don't know, man. I don't know. Fuck these people.
I am so glad that my channel is paid. Because you know what? After this video, I'm going to leave it up because I could use some views. You know, I'm struggling a little bit. But that, that's, you know, I, I love it because I don't have to worry about. I was reading a comment the other day. Someone was, ah, I'm all over the place. I was reading a comment. The guy's like, yeah, Jay is cocky as fuck, man. He was saying all this shit about a uh, company stealing his design. You guys remember when I did the rice launcher? The Y rice, whatever the fuck that was, where it popped up the call and I said it would be cool. So if it popped up, and it popped out. Then a week later, Spire announces some shit on Twitter. They're like, we've got a sub on tank that pops the coil out. Okay. Let that go. But now that my videos are hidden behind a paywall, that means Aspire and all these companies, if they want to steal my ideas, they're going to have to fucking pay and fish through the videos to figure out what, what design do they want to come up with. I don't give a shit what anybody says. This is a very cocky statement I'm about to make. There is one person that comes to mind that is extremely innovative. And this is throwing no shade. And any, because people are like, you go, you throw everybody underneath the bus that you don't like. Bullshit. Bullshit. I still get along great with Mike Vapes, Grim Grit Nick. Oh my God. Are you fucking kidding me? Matt, get the fuck out of here. Don't, don't speak for us, right? Anyway, but I'm going to, I'm going to tell you this. This is going to be a bold statement, but I stand by this 100%. There's only one person that was, that was a reviewer that I would say was extremely, extremely innovative. I think that I am the most innovative vape designer that there is. And I say that fucking proudly. I say it proudly. You can look at that however you want. I'm sure there's plenty of fucking people in chat that will agree to that. I could show you designs that will blow your fucking mind. Now, when you show me an RDA that just has two strips of mesh, I'm not impressed. If you show me a fucking billet box instead of your own design, your own Boro tank, I'm not impressed. Unless that does something different, I'm not impressed. I took, I took out this whole idea. I took out this whole idea, this whole concept. And I said, you know what? I, I really don't want to say it here, but uh, look. Mm. Yeah, I don't want to say here, but I, 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 I'll give you a hint, okay? You, you can take a Boro tank and make it do multiple things, have multiple uses, but instead it's just easier to just do like everything else does because that's what everybody else is doing. That's that whole Me Too movement. To me, that's like seeing somebody do a riot and you just want to be part of that mob mentality and just get in line and have no idea that it's a march for gay rights, but you totally against homosexuals right like you just oh a mob i want to join it have no idea what the fuck it's for but that's just what that's what this this whole vape realm is and i, I promised myself the other day in mill doing a review i'm not gonna buy chinese products anymore as far as like rdas and shit it's not gonna happen i'm done i'm folding up shop unless it's got a vape reviewer's name on it because i hold them to a different standard i'm not gonna promote a fucking company uh that i i don't i don't like what they're doing i'm not gonna do it Unless it's a vapor view. But even then, I'm not going to promote it. I'm going to tell you how it is. But I don't have a problem telling you, hey, you know what? When I designed this, the main premise of this was the Haze Mod, which is based off of the shell of the iJoy Dual 26650. The idea of the perception is taking what Brian from TVC did. Do you see what I do here? I have no problem saying this. It's these other fuckers that have a problem doing it. I have no problem saying how he did the tube mechanism. He he wasn't necessarily the first one to do it, but he was the one that is the most impactful, right? What? Kanger Tech drip box. That's right. The that, original. People don't remember that. The Kanger Tech drip box with the little pump jammy. Right? It had like a little perfume bottle. A glass bottle. Like it's that vintage. That, that's right. It was a glass. I don't I don't think I fucking no, have it. No, you gave it to me. It's right. the first one. It's a little, little. So, but but either way, Brian spinned it off and did his own shit. He had to give product to Kanger Tech. Fuck them. Fuck, fuck them. Right? So we did well. But I'm going to take that and change that and make it even better. 
but I fucking tell you. Do you see the difference? I don't have a problem fucking saying it. These people that are slapping their name on shit, like Mr. Just Right One. Oh, I made this. No, you didn't. All you did was take the profile and cut the fucking deck in half. That's like saying, oh my God, I, I, so innovative, so designful. I made so many design changes. I'm just gonna make the Jenna inside the deck instead of four holes, five. <gasps> oh my God, so innovative. You have no idea what goes in that hole, but that's okay. That's okay because it's different, right? And then you dumb fucks buy it. Congratulations. Congratulations on buying something that is gonna be ridiculous. I'm not even gonna buy it. There's no point, no point. No point. Well, no point. I don't know how to fucking do mesh anyway. Unless China's gonna send me some mesh strips. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. There's one reviewer that I believe did design their own product. It just did not work out well. Who's this? Morton Owen. I believe he designed Morton, it. Morton, I'll tell you this. Morton was a fucking champ, man. Morton, <laughs> Morton's out there cleaning windows. Uh, yeah, he was, you know, he... I believe it. Yeah, he. I believe he was. Out. Yeah, because I saw the drawings. Like, literally saw them. That was the guy that was on Inside the Mods. A crazy fucking guy that wore the... Uh... The beads in his beard. Then who? Okay, this fucking Steam Island Company. So, then, who else breaks it? Oh, wait. Yo, okay, also... Future heads up, don't buy anything from Steam Island. Fuck this company. Because now they're 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 backtracking. They're pussies. I said, he says, um. Yo. What did he say in another email? This hold on. Hold on. Give me a sec. He's saying it's not even in the fucking email. Bro. The fuck are you talking about? This is in your fucking email, dude. I thought you designed it. I thought you wrote it. <laughs> this guy's retarded. Oh my God, yo. What are you going to do to help secure a future for vaping? Absolutely fucking dick. That's what I'm going to do. I can't help you. Neither can a senator. Neither can any reviewer. Neither can any advocacy. I know that that sucks for you. I know that that's pretty hard to wrap your head around, but there is nothing that can save vaping in America anymore. Vaping as we know it, the only thing that would help save it is the PMTAs. And if you expect me to help you save vaping, talk about a selfish ass move. Uh, what the fuck have you done to save vaping? I signed a petition. You signed a petition? How'd that work out for you? It got nowhere. Oh, that's right. <laughs> um... made illegal by overlords and you seem to promote division Some promote division i guess i'm like trump right we're not gonna get into politics promote division then fucking leave man why the fuck are you here why are you watching the stream right now if you don't like what you're seeing then turn it off if you don't like the media do you continue to watch it or do you just turn off the tv i don't fucking tell you man promote division yeah i'm divided because i got me and my coat we good those are the people that pay my fucking bills the people that donate Help me get my proper blowjobs, right? If it wasn't for them, I wouldn't have warm feet. <laughs> right, so that's, if you want to consider that uh, dividing people, no, man. You guys divided me when you considered me the outcast and the piece of shit because, because I created drama. You created that division, not me. I just told you how I felt. What's up? He's written letters. And cold. And how has that worked out for you, TK, after all those letters you wrote? Oh, that's right. Vaping's banned. <laughs> so it didn't work.
Right, you fought from your house. Did you go to uh, Did you go to the rally in D.C. And, and stomp your feet out there for them not to ban it? No, you probably didn't. What have I done? I've done a lot. Was it enough? Nope. Do I give up? Yep. There's a time when you when you have to throw the fucking towel in, man. I'm not gonna fight. I'm not gonna fight a fight that I can't win. Right? If I see a bunch of if I see 15 people outside with bats. And I just come out there like big old Mr. Tough Guy and fight all 15. Do I expect to win? No. Would I get in that fight? No. You know why? Because I'm going to lose it. I'm not going to fight a battle that's not worth fighting. Is that too much honesty? I don't know what to tell you. That's it, Cicero. You fucking nailed it, kind sir. Uh, they call the action when it's just a point and click passive bullshit. Yeah, sign this petition, the White House will look it over. We got well past 100,000. It took forever for it to get there. Which was weird. Forever. For all these people that faith, like, that wanted I to save, it took forever. And then they were like, oh, uh, White House didn't see it. Duh. <laughs> <laughs> like, I hate to hit you with a nine-year-old term, but duh. Like, no, they didn't see it. They don't give a fuck. Like, that's... If I don't need to get into this, I was more for drama. I don't give a shit about what happens to the vape realm. Look, I fought this fucking battle for many years. I've lost businesses. I've lost millions, not a hundred thousand millions of dollars. So, uh, yeah, don't come at me with, uh, what are you going to do to save it? Uh, nothing. I'm just going to do me. I'm going to do my reviews like I promised. And uh, that's it. What do you want me to do? Tell you I'm a glass out with a picket fence. Fight the good fight. Stand up for what we believe in. VLM. Vaping lives matter. That's what I should do. Picket fence. How'd that work out for BLM? I'm done here. We haze. There you go, damn man. That's what we do. You know what's crazy, though? Hazers, get ready for this. Less than lower than vaping. That's bad. When there's, we'll call vaping a fad, right? Because that's what the government calls it. Let's just, let's just agree. It was a fad. That died down. Hazers are strong. I am a hazer and loved by none. <laughs> Yeah, that bike has always been there. Well, it's always been a bike. Triumph, KTM. I think that's it. Triumphs and KTMs. Right? Yeah, Triumphs and KTM. I don't think it's been anything else. Super Dukes. No, that's it. No, I don't do motorcycles. Asking for unity and help. Look, you're you're in the wrong place, man. You're not going to get that here, TK. You want unity, you become a hazer. <laughs> <laughs> and he started with, what are you doing to yeah, save you Yeah, you, you started off with your fucking fist flying, bro. You start off with, what are you doing instead of trying to, it seems like you're doing all division or dividing everybody. You started half cocked. So <laughs> don't don't come at me. All on your high horse with your little shield and your joust, right? I, I Look, I'm not doing anything to save vaping. Nothing, nothing. I could be like Rip, though, and say that me doing reviews is advocacy. <laughs> Did you guys forget about that? I could also tell you that I won't do any more reviews for pod devices because I don't believe in them. But that would be lying, right? I could also tell you that if I put certain lotion on my knuckles, it'll stop them from being dry and that vaping has dehydrated me. But you guys fall for that shit and you give me shit. <laughs> the difference is though, I respond to hate. Other people don't. It's just funny how people say I'm drama. 
when I read these other Facebook groups, and all they do is talk shit. And their mods and admins do nothing. We do not tolerate that at Wix and Coils. You even mention somebody else's name. You can, like, post the product and talk about the product. That's one thing. Don't start assassinating someone's character. Don't do it. Leave that up to me. I'll do it. I'll do it. Because I can take the heat. Plus, I need the fuse. You think I'm getting upset right now, TK? You got me twisted, brother. I'm not upset. I'm not upset in the slightest. I'm not upset. Well, there you go. See you later. <laughs> He's too pushy for his own weird agenda. Like <laughs> Adam Ad Adamizer, Twisted Messes, self-funded. Followed by Groom Green and Umbro LC. They fund it completely. Win or lose based on them alone. Absolutely, Charlie. You are absolutely accurate. Absolutely. Absolutely. 100%. It's hard to sell those. Absolutely. I remember, and I, I'm sure I could say it now. I remember they approached me at the expo and uh, Twisted Message was showing me the deck design of one of the, I, uh, was it? It might have been the Dang or something. One of the goats. Or, no? Not that one? No, I think it's Twisted Messes RDA. Oh. Either way, yeah, they fund it. They fund it. These fucking people that are slapping their name on shit, they're not doing nothing. They're not doing nothing. Because they don't believe in it. If it was their own money, oh my God. I want to see them put up $60,000. I want to see it. I want to see sixty grand being put up for a product that you slap your name on. Oh, that's right. You don't have to do that. So Grim, Homeboy OC... Twisted Messes, the three of them together, they do it all by themselves. And you can't help but uh, commend that. You know, that's, 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 you're believing in what you're making. Enough to fund it with your own money. Like that's. And hit or miss, hopefully you get a hit. Hit or miss. You know, that, I can't help but give that a high fucking five, man. You're believing, you know, no, what is it? No. There's no greater risk. Hold on. A risk worth not taking. You have someone come up. You want to talk to him on the intercom? He's going to come oh. in. Try to open a door. And walk away. No intercom. Wow. It did. You're absolutely right, Dan Matt. I, I got calm. I didn't get more upset. You drama queen. Yes. Yes, I'm a drama queen. But look how many people are in here. So it works, yeah. No. Oh, so much for drama queen that everybody hates with 400 fucking people in here. And Jay's been minding his own business. I'm minding my own fucking business. <laughs> I've been minding my own business, doing my own shit, opening up businesses in Belgium and UK and Greece. What the fuck? You think, <laughs> like, you, you, what are you, what the fuck are you guys talking about? Like, Jay, you are all drunk. Bro, I got no skin in this game. Like, I got nothing. I got All I got is people that follow me, that give me money, and I just vape, right? And I'll do a review here or there, because I said I would. But I did, oh my God, yo. Uh, Jesus. And this was brought to me, not the other way around. Not the other way around. Slap your fucking name on shit. I just did a review of of, of a product from some dude, Kahlo Vapes or Coco, Co Coco Beware. <laughs> yes, <laughs> that's a that's an actual wrestler, uh, the black guy with the parrot. Uh, so the, 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 whatever the fuck, Coco Salo or some shit. So I did a review and he labeled his shit, and I'm making this public. I, I don't want to, but I, actually, I think in a video I said I did because I was promoting hazers, but um. Yeah, he talks about it being the tiniest dual 22 millimeter RDA. You're not going to get any tinier than this. Like, it's a, you're not. For a dual coil. Nope. Nothing. But he touted himself as that. I called him out. These people got to be held accountable for the shit that they say. If you're going to hold me accountable for what I say, I'm going to hold these other people accountable. And if you don't, I'll do it for you. I ain't got no shit in here. You think I did? Look, I'd rather be at Twitch right now. Making money. You think me being here on YouTube is what? What do we get for donations? How, how much donations we get? 
Like 20 bucks? $8. What the fuck? It, it, it ain't views. I mean, it will help out my channel for views, but it ain't going to help the algorithm at all. And the, the, the demonetiz demonetization of vape? YouTube's crazy, man. They're going to fucking monetize this video, even though I'm, like, calling people out. But I'm not talking about a vape product, like, selling it, so it'll be good. And I'll get, like, 12 bucks from it. So that's nice. All right, Moto Vapor, send me, a, send me a link when you do it, brother. Paulie, that's Paulie, right? Thank you, Paulie G. He sounds like he's from Jersey. His name is Paulie G. Hey, Paulie, what's that? Jersey Shore or something? Yeah. Right? <laughs> or Paulie D, isn't it? Paulie D? Uh, I think it's Paulie D. I think that's Paula Dean. That might be too. I don't, I don't know if that's Isn't she sing or some shit? <laughs> yes! She sings with butter. I like that name, World of Tank Blitz. God, I miss that game. What? Try to hook up that M1 Mac last night. Can't do it. It's choppy as fuck. So I have to go back to the uh, 99. Nine. <laughs> it's because you're so obnoxiously pushy and condescending to everyone else that no one else wants to hear it. It's not polite to tell other people they're not doing enough. Yeah, the problem the problem is, TK, again, I hate to keep beating this dead bush, but, uh, you know, the, you came in with your fist flying, right? Talking about me dividing the community. I'm not dividing shit, right? I'm, I'm not, I, I don't. What is me dividing these two reviewers that I'm calling? Well, actually, three, four, four reviewers that I'm calling out. They're fucking fake, man. I don't, I don't know if I'd call Todd fake. I, I don't think Todd is a fake person. I don't. I think he's legitimately real. See, I could say something positive about somebody. I think he's legitimately real. He just has that weird, retarded sense of humor, you know, that you people from the UK have. Uh, I, don't, I don't think he means any harm. Uh, the other people, uh, maybe not mean harm, but they're just slapping their name on shit, saying that they designed it. Just come out with it and just be like, hey, look. I, to me, you'd get more respect if you were like, wow, you know, Watofo hit me up and said, uh, you want to do this shit? I said, yep. <laughs> okay. Now, instead of lying to, be, to, to begin with, you know, oh, no, 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 I designed it. Show me the drawings. And I want to see a date of the email of when it was sent on the top and the header information. And before you say you don't have that, pull out the information on the top, all the made of data. Show me that, that you sent that email with that picture of a drawing. You don't fucking do shit. I got you, Matthew. I got you right here. Here it comes. Matthew, uh, Matthew. Thank you, Daddy O. Corky from Life Goes On. <laughs> yeah, I, you know, I, again, um, they, they just they, in their group they talk a lot of shit, man, and and. You know, that, like always, they always bring up my daughter because it's like a, I, I don't know, they think that that's going to work or something, but they're only talking shit to those people, not to me. Anybody has something to say, you could come see me anytime and say that to my face. 861 U.S. Highway 1, Edison, New Jersey. I invite you to talk all that shit that you talked in these groups to my face. Or when I come to UK, uh, Dan, where in UK are we going? Tell me again in UK where I'm flying out to. Dan, hit me up. Someone um, actually called Matthew in chat. Like, this is, is there really? This is oh, there's an actual Matthew. <laughs> no, you're not. It's the other guy. Um, now all the Matthews are going to say something. Uh, <laughs> M-A-T-T-C-H-U. That's Matthew. <laughs> So, Steve Milan, again, with another response. 
guys with the fucking zingers. This is too much. Look, dude, the remarks in any of our email campa- campaigns have, have got absolutely nothing to do with you or breaking smashing habits. I honestly didn't know what your problem is here. You're not that important, mate. Oh, I'm important enough for you to lose sales. Also, who else would you be talking about? Would you be talking about? What other person breaks stuff? You're backtracking. Again, I cannot tell you enough. Do not purchase from the Steam Island Company. Do not purchase from them. If you did, stop. You know, if you- I'll send you to another site that I know from France that will give you good support and not talk shit about reviewers and their emails trying to be funny. If he just, like, the first time you emailed and he was like, yeah, it's just a joke, you know, to try to make people laugh, he would have been like, okay. But Right now he's saying that he didn't say it. He's a fucking pussy. He is. Like, fucking man up, dude. Fuck these people. Fuck these pussy bitches. BBs. Yeah, and Steam Island Rob. Yes, Rufus. Thank you, D-Wolf. That's what I'm talking about. Who else calls Todd the guy in the shed and breaks products? Like, like, who else are you fucking talking about? I'm not that important. Yeah, there you go. Thank you, Matthew. Important enough to send you an email and be bothered. <laughs> Hey, fucking men, Willow. The internet has made the world entirely too comfortable running their mouth without immediately... Di- I don't know about dire consequences, but there should be consequences. Yeah, that's why this, uh, people have run their mouth, man. They get blocked on Instagram, Facebook, and shit. Yeah, if someone's not important, you wouldn't respond at all. That's right. Just, uh, I amend it out. If you, yeah, if I wasn't important, why are you even responding to the email? You just throw it away. Before you're like, what are you talking about? I don't know what you're talking about. Well, who else are you fucking talking about then? What? Give me another reviewer that breaks products a few weeks after they come out. Give me the name. Give me a name. Anybody. Go. Right. Yeah, I'm getting skinnier, man. You saw my video, how much I'm pushing the scales at now? 241, well, 244, 241. Down from 258, I'll take it. But I'm a fatty, though, so don't listen to the scale. The scale's broke. I purposely brought a, bought a scale that doesn't say the proper weights. It just winks at you. <laughs> Why is the battery cap on the new mod so shit? On mine? This? Do you have the mod that you want to talk yeah, about? Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. Do you do you own the mod, Dale Anglin? Do you own the mod? Do, do you own one? Did you make a mod? Yeah, that's right. You're nobody. But what the fuck are you talking? Do you own one? Do you own, do you own it? Do you, do you own one of these, Dale Anglin? Yeah, you own one? No, I didn't think so. Or, or are you talking about the other mod, the mod that you can't buy? That one, the one that like resells for like twenty two hundred dollars? That one? Ah, you're probably right. I, I don't know. Are you talking about the toilet paper that I sell? That's like five hundred dollars. It's just got my name on it. So when people wipe their ass, it's my name inside of their butt cheeks. Is that the one you talk? I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know. Mm. 
everyone should pop on over to Twitch. So that way they can use my new stickers. I'm pretty so excited about these fucking stickers. They are cute as sin. All right. You don't want one of these mods, though. The battery caps are shit, Brady. You don't want this. So let me take a, a moment of time saying if you guys want more drama, head over to my Twitch. HTTPS <laughs> twitch.tv slash JS. Thank you. Thank you very much. And I'm out of here because I got to go fix my battery cap. You guys be good. Stay beautiful. Remember, someone loves you. And it's probably Mr. Just Right One or Todd or Deuces Jack here. <laughs>